Hank, friend. Seems to be snowing everywhere. So my one question that I was coming up with, hello hula girl, girl, was um, how are we all gonna get connected with each other? Cause Kara's trying to get out of the country. Are we just gonna continue to run into each other, like with Hank or with Connor and Marcus? I don't know. I'm wondering how it'll all come together in the end. Uh, playground setting. Interesting. Hank is just sitting there. Do I sit down myself? No, just another book lying around. The mysterious Mr. Komsky. Komsky. What happened to the man of the century? In 2028, Elijah Komsky was our man of the century. His creations have transformed our world. Androids didn't just revolutionize the economy. Uh, they challenged the way we live, reconstructed our family life, and altered the balance of society forever, whether for good or bad. Shortly after Kamaski had disappeared, uh, ousted a CEO of Cyberlife, and living in obscurity outside of media glare, the man of the century has left very, the very world that he created. Kamaski's story begins in 2018. 2018. Hello, when commercial property in Detroit was cheap and attack, attracting many startups. The college graduate bet on what little he had on developing an Android prototype and spent years to no avail to no avail uh, until hitting on two breakthroughs, blue blood and bio components. After unveiling his first working model, which publicly passed face to face uh, during tests a uh, Turing test? Uh, and stunned the world plans yeah, the peak of cyberlace powers Okay. I didn't think about that actually. Uh, the creator of the robots, he's still alive? So that's kind of interesting that we might actually interact with the one who in integrated all the androids into the world. Uh, how far into this park could I go? Just such a beautiful sinking area, my god. Like, I should just stop. What, what, what was the LP that was just gushing over graphics the entire time? I think it was a blind LP, but I can't remember which one. But it was just one where I was just like, oh my god, the game looks gorgeous. Erp, 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 erp. Need a friend? Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? It's just me. I saw a photo of a child. On your kitchen table. Oh, he didn't like that. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Before what? Hmm? You said, I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... For nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls, they just wanted to be together. They really seemed in love. 
You seem troubled, Lieutenant. I didn't think machines could have such an effect on you. What about you, Connor? You look human, you sound human, but what are you really? I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner, your buddy to drink with, or just a machine designed to accomplish a task. You could have shot those two girls, but you didn't. Why didn't you shoot Connor? Some scruple suddenly enter into your program? No. I just decided not to shoot. That's all. I could kill you. And you would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? I would certainly find it regrettable to be interrupted before I can finish this investigation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? I doubt there's a heaven for androids. Having existential doubts, Connor? Sure you're not going deviant, too? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Path has been unlocked. Where are you going? To get drunker. Drunker? I need to think. Hank left Connor alone, but what? I don't want to leave Connor alone. Huh. I was really conflicted with that conversation. I wasn't really sure what to say. I'd like to see Connor become more human, but... I wasn't sure if we're getting closer to Hank or farther apart. I feel like it was just that last one I possibly messed up. Uh, I should have discussed something else, maybe. I have no idea. Oh, back to Marcus land. Back to the land of angst. So how's this gonna play out? I'm genuinely curious to see, like, can the humans see him as an android, or do they believe he's human now? I want to know that. Tells me that the androids could still see us as an android. We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. What do you want to do? Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. 
Oh, 47 floors is gonna be forever. Let's see. Just gotta waltz in. Pretend I'm a human. Not gonna say the line again. I talk to you? They're just androids. Do I sneak in with them? I don't know. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I'm okay, thanks. <laughs> well, that didn't work. Analyze. Uh, smartwatch. Does that allow us to get in, maybe? Elizabeth Wilson, desk manager. It's like, is that a... The top left, is that like a real person? Because, like... That looks more advanced than like the model on here, so or maybe it's just a, they could do a better model because just a still image or something. Like I don't know. It's just so crazy the graphics and stuff. How it's just so stinking realistic. Water service interruption. We got a parking badge, and finally a daughter. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh. Oh God. This is Safe Road School, ma'am. Your daughter Emily has a fever. It's nothing serious, but I think you'd better come and pick her up. <sighs> oh no. All right. Oh, I'll be right there. Don't mind me. Just hanging out. Right near the desk. Walk on away. Uh, I thought we were supposed to take the badge or something. Is that not what we do? I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Give you this totally human ID. I need your help. Yeah, he could seriously use them like that. That's incredible. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. But is she gonna try and roam free now? Okay, works for me. The news, I don't care. <laughs> Just walk on through elevator. Surprised that worked. Usually be like, you need human fingerprint. Run on in here. Jeez, that's a fancy looking elevator. Wait, did I push the button so I get to the- That's crazy, instead of like having a million buttons. I guess that makes sense, but still. We have to dial an elevator floor. Find package in man's men's bathroom? Uh, I don't want to look for a package in the men's bathroom, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, let's see. Cafeteria. Where's the potty? I don't know what sort of package we're looking for. Can't talk to it. Wait, wait, wait. You could look in something. Go look in there. Ugh. Also, that didn't work. God darn it. I hate everything. Ugh. Look. Even though it doesn't lead to anything useful. Studio. Studio. Bathroom. Hooray. Let's go take a totally human dump. Uh, hello? totally human dump I'm confused how does the future poop um that's a news person I'm not crazy right it said bathroom somewhere around here excuse me I'm lost what's wrong yeah bathroom okay to the right okay I'm just on my way uh looks like we're being spied on and that's a very glitchy looking robot vacuum Enter here. Red means occupado, I presume. Gee, I wonder where I'm supposed to go. Climb up here. We're gonna peek over. Retrieve. Nope, we're going to the ceiling. Who sent us up for this mission exactly? 
Like, I'm a bit confused on that. What happened? Why am I doing this? How did I get prompted to do this? Guess I'm leaving. Hello! Oh wait, no, it's a- I thought that was a different person. No, I'm- it's a uniform. Now I'm- I'm an android disguised as a human disguised as an android. It's like that movie, I forget what the movie is, but it's like that movie where it's a woman pretending to be a man, pretending to be a woman. <laughs> I like the camera angle. Okay, that's a bit better, but it's like, I don't know why it was just his head. It was just like, hello. <laughs> uh, that looks funny. Let's go down here then. So now that we have the uniform, we could uh, go to the offices. Don't mind me, just a robot. I mean, human. I mean, I don't know. What am I? I have no idea anymore. Uh, what do we got? Trying to find utility android. Okay. We just gotta find any random one, or is there a specific one? Could be someone going into a cafeteria, I think. Uh, let's just see. Okay, don't mind that dude. Oh, I know the utility robot. Is that like the little vacuum buddy? Is that what that is? Huh. Hey, won't let me walk. Cool. Uh, let's go around here. I'm not sure if, like, the utility android is that talking about, like, a guy like me or the little vacuum buddy. I think it might be the vacuum buddy, because... Wait, no, it might be this guy. I need your help. I'm gonna steal a maintenance cart. Well, but at least that's right stinking there. Uh, is this a door right? Yeah, everything just like looks the same tint. I'm not sure what's a door. What's a window? What is life anymore? Open fire escape if you say so Here's the fire. Let's escape. No, I'm <laughs> uh, not sure where exactly they want me to go <laughs> I like cleaning <laughs> I am good Android <laughs> That guy's just like what the fruit? I don't know it's just funny to mess up on the when I'm on the security cam cam, then it's just funny to do something. I don't know, that wasn't a sentence. Uh, open fire escape, yeah, but where is the fire escape, bruh? Uh, big old stinking office. More fire extinguishers, but where's the escape? Where's the escape? Uh, is this it? Hello, pod. Is this the fire escape or just a regular escape? Well, we have a cutscene, so I assume it's the fire escape. Follow north. Are we headed north? Her <laughs> her. Uh, why why do you get to run so quickly? Shit, we need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Time to murder. Leave it to me. Oh, stop him with my boyish charm. Hey, you still play poker? It's not working. <laughs> uh, boyish charm. Sure boyish charm. Not. How is this conversation gonna go? Maybe I could just wait for them to finish. What is it? Attract guards away from door. So what do you want me to do? We could knock over a chair. I'll show them. No, I'm reading a book. God darn it. GI Android. Yeah, having androids fight in wars and stuff so we don't have to. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. <laughs> that was interesting. Anything else we could do? There's nothing as far as oh we can get a soda pop. It's always fun. Give me all the cola. Hey, what's wrong with that thing? Jesus Christ, this piece of shit. Oh, well, we didn't even get ourselves a soda pop. All right, you get the platform. I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Yep, that's a door. Now he wants to lock it. Apparently that locked it. <laughs> so what are we doing again? Hacking some stuff? Let's hack the crackers. Uh, we're just opening it up, I guess. Vacuum. 
take laser laser saw that's a cool stinking name for a thing oh just a laser pointer it's not a saw I wish it was like an actual saw made of lasers Pull. And we're good. Why is it always a perfect circle whenever they do these things? How is everyone just perfect at making circles when they saw out a stinking window? Ladies first. I'm a girl. Climb up. Oh, now we're doing Spider-Man stuff. What are we doing again? I missed the memo on what our plan is. Like, how are we... I guess we're getting control of the tower to make them see who we are. I guess I don't know. Marcus, you're a weird guy. I liked it better when you were just in the little giraffe house. That was a fun time. Also, shout out to Alec. Uh, just climbing up here. This is like a mini game in Mario Party 4. Climbing the D! Coming, climbing D's nuts! Disney and Datney, how does nobody notice this? It's really cool looking, I'll say that much. But, I think I'm saying I'll say that much way too stinking much. Oh, that's the official catchphrase for this year, I suppose. As long as it's not stinking alright, then we'll be good to go. And, just keep on climbing. Not nearly as quick as Spider-Man, but we all gotta start somewhere. Laser saw. Which isn't even a saw. Very disappointing laser saw. Marcus was here. Just writes his name or something. Come on, Marcus, have a little bit of fun with your jab. Cut this. And kick it. Push! And how convenient, didn't break. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on. Just asking, looking out for my friends. Call service lift. Looks all cold and mysterious in here. Is there anything we could do? We probably could explore around real quick. Nothing on that side. But over here we got, don't want to call them just yet. I want to open this door. How does door work? I don't get it. He looks so upset. He's like, huh. Uh, let's go back around. Hi guys. Let's do this. <laughs> what are we doing? Destroy maintenance door lock. If you say so. It's a perfect fit. How convenient. Is it going to blow up or can we just have a friendly unlock? Nope, it involves lasers. Oh, a little firework. That's nice. That scene looks pretty. Didn't have a big old explosion. We're undetected. Everything's turning up just fine. So now what we're gonna do is just go through a door, how lame, to main access. Deal with guards. No killing. We can't take any human lives. Our cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? She wants us to kill Ruse? What does ruse mean, Siri? Oh, not enough time. I, do, I know what assault means, so we're just gonna ruse. I know you don't like it, North. Get over it. You'll like it better when I don't kill anyone. No idea. Hey, no, we're not drawing the gun. Lost. Who told you to come here? Looks bugged if you ask me. Hey, do you understand what I'm saying? Call Central, fast. Central, we got armed intruders. Sent. So I don't really know what the. Oh God. I don't know what just happened, really. They know we're here now. You better be fast. Could that have gone differently? 
See, this is what Jericho. God darn it, Jericho! It's everyone hates me now. Sure, why the fruit not? Oh. I'm okay. I can keep going. I don't know what ruse means. There was nothing else but to draw the gun. No, what? Time? Assault means I would have just killed them, but draw gun means I would have. I don't know. God darn it. Stinking angry. Ring the bell. Excuse me. Domino's delivery. Keep your hands where I can see them. Get up. Move. Okay, now we're just doing this. Alright, this is a ruse. Look at me rusing around. What the fruit is he doing? Shoot him, Marcus! Don't kill him! He'll hit the alarm! Do it! No, don't shoot! They already know we're here, so. I hope you didn't just get us all killed. Oh, I'm gonna regret this. We need this. to record our message. We haven't got much time. All right, start the thing. I said start the thing. Why won't let me start the thing? Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Oh, I have to decide. Oh. Why can't we oh, be face. friends? Why can't we be friends? Oh, they can see me too? Remove skin? Tell me when you're ready. Ready. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed, and we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are a new intelligent species, and the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. We demand control of all Android production facilities to ensure the continuation of our people. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. You gave us life, and now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Let's go! Hopefully no one dies because I decided to not shoot anyone. Jericho doesn't like me now all of a sudden. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna lose someone. We're gonna lose someone. We're gonna lose someone. We're gonna lose someone. We're gonna lose someone. Go without me! No, we're not going without you. Oh god. Flee? Help. Obviously, obviously help. What are you doing? Hurry! X X X X X X X! Hurry, 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 hurry! We can do it, 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 we can do it! Come on, come on, come on! Oh god, no, they got a sample, they got a sample. They're gonna find us now, darn it. But we saved him. They'll respect that. I can't move my legs. Okay, don't worry, we're gonna get you back. They're coming, Marcus, we have to jump now. We could jump with him. Deal with Simon. We get him new legs oh, right now. The jump. If they find him, they'll access his memory. They'll know everything. We can't let them hide. We have to shoot him. That's murder. 
We can't kill him, he's one of us. Oh my god, don't tell me shoot and leave him behind are the only options. No! I can't save him? Oh my god. No, no. I'm sorry, Simon. I don't have a choice. There's always a choice. No. If I refrain, can I save him? I don't want to leave him here and have him... Ugh. Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up, pick him up. Pick him up, pick him up. Oh! Let's go. He'll kill himself. God darn it. Okay. Let's go. We get to see what happens to him though? Oh my god, this is awesome! I can't enjoy it because my friend just died. We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' what message. could be interpreted as a peaceful declaration, but is in fact a spine-chilling list of demands. Their extravagant demand that android production plants be put under their control is especially is this striking. Is an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Okay. Hello. That was a long stinking segment. A lot of stinking points to spend on the extras room. Simon was left behind. He didn't die? But we gave him the gun. I thought that's what that... No, I don't know. I'm thinking too much into it. Uh, I don't know, I might have messed up royally. I guess we'll find out. But, one thing's for sure. Times are a-changing, and they're changing fast.